In this video, we'll talk about 2023 Range Rover SV. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. The Range Rover is available with a trio of powertrains, starting with a turbocharged inline 6 with a 48 volt hybrid system, dubbed P400, that develops 395 horsepower. During our initial test drive, it proved to be silky smooth and provided adequate pep to tug the large Range Rover around. A 5.23 HP twin-turbo 4.4-liter V8 engine Land Rover calls it P530 is even perkier and cranks up the Range Rover's towing capacity to 8,200 pounds. At our test track, the P530 hustled the Range Rover to 60 miles per hour in 4.3 seconds. The P400 did it in 5.5 seconds. A 434 HP plug-in hybrid option called p 44 e is also available, but only on the short wheelbase SE trim. Our long wheelbase P400 test vehicle managed to hit 60 miles per hour in a fairly brisk 5.5 seconds, while the short wheelbase P530 we tested did it in just 4.3 seconds. The Range Rover's ride is suitably plush and with its adjustable air suspension set to comfort mode. It virtually floats down the road. Turning the dial to dynamic mode firms things up some, but the big rover still aims for a comfort first mission. The EPA hasn't released official range estimates for the plug-in hybrid P440E, but Land Rover says the system's 31.8 kWh. Battery pack should provide around 48 miles of electric-only driving range. The P440E is capable of DC fast charging or can be charged at a home-based charger. All models receive a new 13.1-inch curved infotainment display with Land Rover's latest PV Pro interface. Wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto are both standard, and the system also receives Amazon's Alexa voice assistant. Other standard features include in-dash navigation, wireless smartphone charging, Sirius XM satellite radio, and a 13.7-inch digital gauge display. A rear seat entertainment system with dual 1.4-inch displays is available, as is a Meridian stereo system with 35 speakers and noise-canceling technology embedded into the headrests. The most fuel-efficient Range Rover will likely be the plug-in hybrid P440e but the EPA has yet to estimate fuel economy figures for this model. The entry-level P360 and mid-range P400 are both rated for 18 MPG city and 26 MPG highway, while the V8-powered P530 earned estimates of 16 MPG city and 21 MPG highway. On our 75 miles per hour highway fuel economy route, both the P400 and P530 resulted in the same 23 mpg. Thank you for watching this video so much.